Hey everybody, welcome back. Doing another video about Silver Surfer Gates. Uh, everything that's going on about Silver Surfer. We still get deafening response. Are we gonna get something here? Did we get something here? Uh, are we okay with it? Where Where are we at? I mean, it's been, it feels like a month. Uh, it's probably been closer to a week. Uh, I, I don't know. I know there's offers that have come, they've gone. New ones have come, they've gone. There've been screw ups, there've been, you know, then I know some Alliance, I'm like, wait, did the new Silver Surfer Discord, you know, it ended up just needing to reset. So it's kind of like, all right, what's really going on with Silver Surfer here? Are we going to get these offers? Is there going to be a fix? Um, you know, what are they going to do about these exploits in game? You know, is, is are, are people going to be punished for them? All that kind of thing. So uh, we're going to talk about that for a little bit and give you um, uh, my thoughts. And you can put in the comments below what you think. Am I way off? Am I stupid? Yes. Um, am I smart? Eh, sometimes. Depends if my wife told me what to say. That's pretty much the only time. Or my son or my daughter who are young. Uh, that's really all I got. So, uh, yeah. So we're going to go over that. As always, if you're new to the channel, click that like button, the subscription button, if you want to check out content in the future. There's a Discord link in the description below as well. And we uh, like to typically do videos that are, you know, uh, efficiency-based, help with the game some. You know, or just sometimes just fun or rambly like this one might be. But uh, I really want to kind of talk about this a little bit because it's important for the morale of the game, the health of the game. And let's see if we ever get some answers here, right? Did it take too long? I don't know. Anyway, description uh, below also has our sponsors, Amazon Coins, 20% off. Use that link. Helps out the channel as well as uh, some health stuff if you're looking to lose some weight after quarantine or during quarantine. It's really helpful. So I know I'm trying to get back in shape. Anyway, all right, let's get to the video. So, uh, before we get into some of the interweb stuff, you know, so the offers that we currently have are still this, uh, where's it at this $50, it looks to be one-time purchase offer. Uh, look, I'll be upfront with you guys. This offer value is terrible. You know, 60 shards for him doesn't even get me to the next four star, uh, 60 plus the other twenties. Yeah. Maybe I can get a four star. So that's kind of nice, but for 50 bucks, I'll be real with you guys. If I wasn't a content creator, I wouldn't, or if I didn't have a bunch of extra money, you know, not that that's me. I'm saying I'm a content creator. So I'd buy this because I'm a content creator. Or if I was a person who had a bunch of extra money who could afford it on this game, uh, then, you know, I'd be considerate of this, but this offer dollar wise, I would look, I get silver surfer, super cool. He's a new shiny object, literally and figuratively. Um, I, $50 is a lot of pay for, uh, for something like that. Now, again, Amazon Coys makes it a little bit cheaper. Something to think about. But still, this is uh, something uh, I'd really think twice about. That's a lot of money to spend. All these other things are terrible. Uh, ability orbs. Okay, gold orb. You're going to get like uh, 80 to 100K, whatever the average is at this point. You're not going to get any good out of it. So just be wise about that. So this offer came out after we had the screw up of the $20 offers, which as everybody probably knows at this point, was manipulated by a number of people in the game. Uh, it was seen in RTA. It got all over Reddit. It was seen on streams. Uh, clearly, there's some sort of exploit that people are using to be able to do this. And uh, we'll see what happens. I mean, I know a lot of people are debating that like, ban this. Like, they should know it's Scopely's fault. No, kick out the players. It's their fault. They're exploiting it. You know, well, no, it's Scopely's responsibility to take care of this. So, you know, I could see a lot of different sides of it. Um, I'm the type of person, I guess, that uh, I can give somebody a couple mishaps, you know, if they mess up once, all right, exploit. If they mess up twice, uh, you know, you're going to get a little bit punished. If you mess up a third time or if you've exploited something a few times, see ya. I don't need you in my life. I don't need you part of this. You're, you're, you're causing problems here. So again, I'm not a company though. And um, I've got, you know, priorities where uh, aren't specifically money driven. So, you know, if we jump over to the reddits, right? So let's go over to the, uh, the, the wonderful reddit scene. 
and you can start seeing you know the first thing i saw in here is about nine hours ago it's 8 p.m pacific time on march 23rd so you're talking about nowhere from scopey on uh silvergate which i'm not even gonna go to the thread at this point i mean i guarantee it's a bunch of you know folks you know looking for answers which that's fair you know we deserve in my mind answers this is a big deal you know some people are wreaking the rewards of having that uh there's some other stuff here stark tech cool story you know all right uh this is just cheating and exploits there's this one we we're talking about people uh like the devel or the uh, casino who did the exploit all right so this person's attacking casino a little bit but um for more than a year and they actually they're against it he needs, he needs to be setting an example uh there's for his eyes section a big middle finger faces who play fair i'm not sure how this shakes out i was not expecting this to read that way uh never look for justice and people with power they make a living from it some agreements anyway so some people uh we're talking about i know tana shot a video specifically pointing that out um so you know there's clearly um you know some discussions here about what they think about this specific content creator and what he did uh i, I don't know if he did it you know on accident or not i'm not going to even lie to you guys i don't know and frankly i'm going to stay out of all that drama stuff i'm just it's not and i don't have interest in getting into stuff like that so um zeke's and cerebro uh, i'm not even gonna get that's probably a joke on that well let's just check it out let's just see if it's funny yeah all right yeah it's i feel the love there i mean it's the, a little shout out to those two they've probably got one of the harder jobs in all of marvel strike force they are in between a, a mad riding mob and a company that's you know profit driven but also trying to make a game that's fun for people they've got a really hard job i will give it credit and for all the things that they've done stuff where maybe they haven't responded it or you know i respond to me or to the community yeah that's still annoying or whatever but i i also recognize that they both have very difficult jobs to do so i i, I certainly get that um and then there's some talk about the offers and how to fix it so anyway the point is is on reddit the people are still talking about this everybody's looking for a an answer looks like there's uh, a little bit less posts on it today um you know here's the talk <laughs> this one is just talking about the, the um the the offer i just mentioned read the room i hope people don't actually buy this you know and i i have to agree it is pretty predatory it's it's you know look it he is the shiny object i get it um i didn't love that offer i won't ever love that offer it's not a good offer i will never say it's a good offer uh, i can't promote doing it and like i said unless i had a ton of money or i was a content creator who you know made some money off the game or could do write-offs uh I, I don't know so anyway so i was coming on tonight to shoot the video and saying why don't we have an a response to this yet this is unacceptable um i can't believe that we don't have this done yet so and then lo and behold we got a response so um what we got here is and this is a uh, public on the discord servers uh cerebro made a post uh specifically about an hour ago there have been some questions in regard to an issue where a few players were able to purchase a recent silver surfer offer twenty dollars for 50 silver shards limit two, more than the maximum purchase limit meaning that they could buy that offer more than twice upon investigation we have identified five accounts so there's only five people that they're seeing this um, from. So that's that's actually pretty good news. One, we mentioned uh, the casino who did it apparently. And then uh, we know Captain Ireland. I don't know the other, I guess, three people that through a glitch were able to purchase the offer more than twice. The only And only one of those accounts that purchased it more than a total of four times. That had to be in Cap Captain Ireland, of course. This will be corrected and all five accounts will have their excess shards of Silver Surfer removed, mitigating any advantage they may have had. Any additional actions taken on these accounts are considered a private matter with those individuals. So that doesn't necessarily mean that something's happening and it doesn't mean anything's not going to happen. I'm not sure we'll ever know. Uh, depends who it is that gets um, any sort of reprimands if they get none. I guarantee we don't hear about it if they get something again depending on the player i think it depends they might take the red or something you know try to say what happened i don't know but it is a private matter between those individuals i'd expect that scopely tells those individuals if you go public with whatever happens here you're you will be immediately banned i'll tell you that right now that's what i would do if i was scopely i'd say we are doing this this is a repercussion if you say anything about this publicly you will be permanently banned and never be able to play the game again because they are clearly trying 
trying to make it a private matter. We understand that this caused frustration of many of you to see some other players that had more stars in Silver Surfer than should have been purchasable, clearly. Uh, we don't want for you to feel that you somehow missed out, so we have decided to release the same offer, $20 for 50 Silver Surfer Shards Limit 2, for a second round to all players in the near future. Hopefully that near future is sooner rather than later for anybody who really liked that offer and wants to spend more. Uh, I still envision that as much as people are upset with the game, that will probably get eaten up quite a bit. I know that I will certainly buy it, but I am also a content creator who can make some money and do some write-offs for the game. So that is different. So don't do what I necessarily do. Do what is smart for you based on your monthly budget, your income, and the bills that you need to pay. Uh, we and remember this is entertainment. It's a hobby. You should uh, you're never whatever you're purchasing this It's it's the same as lighting uh, fire or lighting your money on fire and throw it in a fireplace if that's what entertains you uh, Tony Scangelli had a good example that I currently can't remember But anyway, it's you, you are this is not an asset. You will ever keep it's gonna disappear one day We will back to the post. We will be closely monitoring the number of purchases Carefully and any account found to acquire it more than twice will be at risk at an indefinite ban. So be warned if you go ahead and try to do this again, you are going to risk an indefinite ban. So they're letting you know that that potential is out there. Intentionally lever leveraging exploits is against our terms of service. And while we know loopholes like this are our responsibility, meaning Scopely's, to oversee, we won't hesitate taking punitive action against players who exploit them while we work to close them. The dev team is currently diagnosing the cause of the glitch and is planning a course of action on how to prevent it from happening in the near future or happening again in the future. Thank you to all who have reported the issues so we can start investigating right away. And thank you for your patience while we conducted a proper investigation. So while I threw a bunch of shade on them saying, hey, why, how long, Reddit, these people are mad. Um, I, I will have to say that, you know, sometimes you can't just get, you know, uh, somebody up at the stand on trial right away. You've got to do some investigation. You've got to figure it out. You've got to make sure that you gather the proper information so you can figure out the right way to actually get these things figured out. So kudos to them. I personally um, am pretty happy with this response. I like it. You know, we'll see what happens in the future. I don't really care about hearing about what happened to those individuals. I just hope that Scopely handles it properly. And I hope the individuals who are getting this done to them, you know, understand that it's meant to be between them and Scopely. So so let me what, what do you guys think you know are you guys okay with this is this something that you're uh upset about you know you think that they need to do more is this not enough uh personally i think it's enough but like i said i want to hear from you guys in the description below or the comments below let me know where you're kind of laying at this let me know if you think that uh they need to punish people more come to the discord chat just the same uh hammer down that like button click the notification bell subscription button all that kind of stuff and until next time i hope you have a wonderful day